Peter, I waited for a while, but either you're running really late or you didn't think we were meeting here. Hopefully you're already there, but if you get this, <laughs> I'm probably there now. Oh, man. I better hurry if I ever want MJ to speak to me again. Great timing. Jonah was just yelling for you. Go on in. <laughs> Thanks, Betty. You were looking for me, Mr. Jameson? Parker! Where were you 15 minutes ago? There's a Latvian diplomat coming into the city by helicopter. He's landing any moment, and I need a photo. Now get over there like your job depended on it. Got it, Mr. Jameson. Invaders holding up a convenience store. This I have to see. Space dude, whatever you say, just don't disintegrate me or whatever. How low the mighty have fallen. You dare to challenge the infinite light of Mysterio? I will destroy you utterly. You will bear witness to the majesty and glory of my power. Prepare to die. You have trifled with my power for the last time. I will not hold back. You face your doom today. No human can withstand the awesome forces that are mine to command! By confronting me today, you have sealed your fate, Spider-Man! Leave while you can, Spider-Man! Don't make me immolate you where you stand! You have proven yourself a worthy foe, so I offer you this last chance to withdraw from the battlefield while you still can! Again. Quentin Beck, I presume. Say cheese. Great. Now to get these photos to the bugle.
have to see Jonah. I have pictures of Spider-Man for him. <laughs> okay, Pete. Go on in. Parker, what do you want? I have some photos you might want to see. Remember Quentin Beck? Turns out, he was Mysterio. So, Beck and Spider-Man weren't cahoots all along. How can you look at those pictures and say that? I don't have time for your moral outrage, Parker. I'm trying to run a paper here and make sure my son's wedding to Jean Marie doesn't bankrupt me. Her name is Mary Jane. Yeah, right, right. I'll give you 200 for the lot. You can collect your money on your way out. <laughs> I can't believe that. Jameson would frame his own mother if he thought it would sell papers. What did I ever do to Jameson? What could he possibly have against me? Help me! Someone help me! Need a hand? Don't hurt me! Wait, I'm trying to help. Uh, I'm so sick of everyone hating me. I'm going to go give the Bugles' esteemed publisher a piece of my mind. He's messed up my reputation long enough. I don't have time to talk. I need to have a word with the publisher of the Daily Bugle. Whoa there, mighty one. Take a deep breath. That paper has turned half the city against me. I'm sick and tired of it. <laughs> well, I'm sure that bursting into the Bugle offices and yelling will clear everything up. All I'm saying is, you may want to calm down. <sighs> you seriously need to loosen up. Have more fun. You're a superhero. You, you swing through New York City in brightly colored tights. I like my costume. The point is, here you are. Powers far beyond those of mortal men. And you're pouting on a rooftop. What's up with that? <laughs> I guess you're right. What did you have in mind? Well, I did find Shocker again. And <laughs> I am dying for some payback. Sounds good. <laughs> All right. Showtime, baby. Surprised that you found Shocker again. Thought he would be smart enough. Yep, I'm on out it. Finding out where he is wasn't easy, but I can be very persuasive when I want. My bad.
little shocker, I'll never forgive you. Okay, okay, I'm coming. Not a problem. <sighs> All right, now let's get back on track. Yeah, lead the way. This is an old Oscorp research lab. Shock's moving up in the world. Yeah, uh, some kind of space propulsion thing. I wasn't really paying attention. I'm gonna find another way in. I'll meet you inside. About time you losers got here. I must have told every low life in New York where to find me. <laughs> <sighs> a trap? Don't take it too hard, Cat. Shocker's a crafty one. No? Wait, I'm thinking of someone else. Get ready. Here comes the pain. I hate it when he says that. I'm gonna find some way to shut down that force field. Okay, I got it. But it looks like there's another panel we have to hit at the same time. Find it and we'll set a field down. They'll need a mop to clean up what's left of you. button here and hit that terminal. Unless you like being shot at. I was right. Look at that shield go down. Let's go teach Ocker a lesson. Right, Spider? Careful, Cat. He's still dangerous. You must lose a filling every time you blast something. This guy gave you trouble, Spider? Yeah, well, I was young. Shield's up again. I'll work on it. Look out for those blasts, okay?
fighter. Get over to that other terminal so we can drop the shield. Good job. Now let's get Shocker. Ooh, playing around. Shocker is still a boring name. What about Jack O'Han? This guy gave you trouble, Spider? Yeah, well, I was young. Hang in there, Spider. Give me a I'll break, try to hack the shield. Was that as good for you as it was for me? I have to admit, you were right. I feel much better. You see? I told you, baby. Stick with me and you'll be fine. Come see me next time you're feeling down, all right? I'll see you around. She's pretty amazing, don't you think, Shock? <sighs> I think my career has just hit a new low. Ah, who cares what you think? If only all my problems could be settled with flashy climactic battles. Mary Jane's play. Maybe I can make it tonight. I'm sure you know all about using the jump button to get off a web while you're swinging, right? Well, if you release at the bottom of your swing arc, you'll launch yourself forward with very little upward trajectory. Okay, this isn't Physics 101, so I'll spare you the explanation for why it happens, but trust me, it all makes sense. Just remember that when you're trying to cover distance quickly, you should try and release the jump at the bottom of your swing arc. Swimming definitely doesn't suit.
got washed all the way over here. I can't believe I missed it again. Good night, guys. See y'all tomorrow. What's up, girly? Give me your money. Leave me alone. Okay. Yeah. Great timing. What are you doing here? You know me. Always hanging around. I'm getting married. I don't know if you heard. Oh, really? What's he like? He's... there. He loves me. And he's there. I see. I, um, I, I have to get back to my patrol. See you around. Yeah, next time a bunch of thugs try to jump me. It's a date. Why can't I just tell MJ the truth? I can't believe she's getting married and I'm just waving from the sidelines. Was I supposed to meet Kat this evening? I guess I should go.